Tim, uh, what's your assessment on that? Because I felt after a bright start, sort of 10 minutes in the end, where we got the red card and conceded the two goals that killed the game, really. Well, it did. I mean, obviously, you've got a mountain to climb with it, you know, down to 10 men for an hour. Um, got the double whammy with the, obviously sending off and a penalty. So that takes us 2 0 down. What really irks me is it's three set plays. You know, for all, all Bore and Woods possession, which of course they, they are going to have when they can put their wing backs high and wide and stretch the pitch when you're down to 10 men and you're trying to slide uh, and cover each other in the second half. Um, for all that, they've scored with three set plays which is unacceptable at this level. You, you, if you cannot defend restarts and you can't defend your own box in the National League, you're wasting your time. So that, that really irritates me, if I'm honest. Um, we went through and we must have spent an hour on restarts for and against yesterday. Um, you know, and sometimes you, you catch someone's eye and they're gawping around or whatever. I said to them, that is why we spent an hour doing them, so that we win first contact. If we don't win it, we win the second contact. So. I'm double irritated with that. Um, I said at half time, listen, what we don't do here is fall apart, capitulate, five, six, seven, no chance, no chance. So we, we set up to, to defend deeper and try and counter a little bit through, um, <clears throat> obviously, uh, Efron, uh, Josh, and, and, and Inni, but certainly defend our box, allow less space in behind us than we did in the first half because Tishy Manga got in far too often and Loach was far too busy. He was excellent, the goalkeeper. Um, so there's, there's lots of things I'm not happy with, but the one thing, the one positive I was happy with was a commitment in the second half. I thought they gave it everything. Having said that, your three zipped down. Do you know what I'm saying? It's, it's all too late. But um, <laughs> I'll probably revisit the video tomorrow and have a look and I'll be all right with the first... 2025, you know, I'll, I'll be gutted with the restarts. Um, we need more. We need more. Uh, I need more from the players. Just told them that, you know, some of, we are not fit enough. I'll guarantee you, we are not fit enough. I'm watching lads blowing, blowing early doors. We've had a week and worked hard this week. I said on Monday morning, expect to be working and grafting hard because we've got to go older shop and be better than what we did today and put up a better performance than we did today and keep trying to improve. Um, Listen, lots, we need help. I think we need help in fairness. I think we need some bodies into the building to help what we've got. You know, there's the, there are certain positions without a shadow of a doubt that we need to improve. Listen, I, I, I don't think I, anyone can say you're talking garbage. We need a couple of bodies in the building quick. Um, so I'll be working on that. Um, so that, that's what I've took out of it, really. Uh, the manner of the goals, as you said, from set pieces, what do we need to do to eradicate that situation? Well, get the better of your man. 1v1, mano a mano, get tighter and win the first contact. And then, by the way, if you don't win the first contact, make sure that somebody else wins the second contact. Listen, we have everybody back for corner kicks. We had a big side, you know, Mojny, Nugent, Effiong, Taylor, Pavey, big boys, by the way. Do not, do not concede first contact in your own box. It's a crime and it ain't good enough. Um, you know, so you cut through all that flannelly, this, that and the other. You've been done by three restarts. So. You know, disappointed with that. You brought Alfie back from Dartford. Obviously, he was sacrificed when he went I down to, to the yeah. ten men. Yeah. Um, I thought he did quite well in the air with, in the first twenty-five minutes. Um, he'll be a boost, another body up from. Yeah, he's another body. Listen, Alfie, I, I'm not saying anything I haven't said to him. He, he needs to get fitter. He needs to get fitter and run about. All right. Now, if you're a centre forward playing in my team, you need to run about. In my last job, I used to play four-three-three with three nines up top, and they used to work themselves into the ground. And they, some of them, one of them was thirty-six. I need to work himself into the turf. I, that's what I expect from my front players. If we're out of possession, get back in. If you're in a 4 3 3 and get in a pocket, do a defensive duty. And when you get it, counter attack. So, listen, Alfie needs to get fitter. I think Alfie's a good player. Listen, we played against Dover a few years back and he caused us all sorts of problems. He's physical and strong. Um, he's had his issues here, whatever. Hooper was injured. He, he tweaked a thigh or whatever on, on Wednesday. So straight away I thought, listen, do we bring him back? He was going to play, I think, for Dartford today, or do we give him the 90? As it happens, I'm glad I brought him back. So, you know, we're going to need him. Uh, but you know, I reiterate, we need, we need to get some, some personnel in. You mentioned about the personnel. For us to have another suspension in yeah. Juddy must be pretty frustrating. It's two signings, isn't it? Yeah. We're two lone boys and bang. Yeah, um, 
you know, both sent off in, on their debuts. Listen, Juddy's as honest as the day is long. I, I, I know a bit, quite a bit about him. We've come up against him at Orient. The kid's a, he's a warrior. He's a soldier. You know, he'll go in the trenches and he'll fight and scrap, and we're going to need that. But I said, I think one of the last things I said before they ran out was make sure we've got 11 men on the pitch. Local derby is going to be committed. Get your foot in properly, play properly, and stay on the pitch. And listen, as it happens, it's not a tackle, it's an handball, but nevertheless, you're an hour with 10 men, and that's hard work. There's going to be some, some tired bodies in there. You said it'll be another busy week in the build-up to all the shot. What what would your message be to the fans? You obviously be disappointed to yeah, have lost in the absolutely. way we did. Oh, yeah, hundred percent. Listen, I, I think if they were here, they'd have seen a team that's giving their best but not good enough at the moment. Not quite good enough, um, you know. And that's not being disparaging in any way. Shout this, and they're all great lads. They're having a right go, but we're not good enough. Um, simple as. So you know, the, the needs to be uh, in the coming weeks some change of personnel we obviously brought two in and as you as you say you know they've both been sent off in their on their debut so that's that's not good but uh, we we do need a few more and I'll be endeavoring this week to try and do just that